Hello and welcome to Web Dementors YouTube channel and you are watching Python tutorial series for beginners. So in this video we are going to see about math in Python. Well, there's a lot of mathematical functions that you can perform with Python just like every other programming languages. And these mathematical functions can be performed with the help of these symbols. Well, there are a lot of mathematical symbols that you can use with every programming languages and you can also use them in Python. So plus is for addition, so you can add two numbers in order to get a value for that. And then minus for subtraction, again, you can subtract two numbers. And slash for division, dividing two numbers can be performed by this symbol. And asterisk for multiplication. So if you want to multiply two numbers, you can use asterisk. The percentage symbol can be used for finding the modulus value between two numbers. More symbols are less than for finding the number which is lesser compared to the other number. For example, it will check if the number on the left side is less than the number on the right side. So if it is less, then it will return true as a Boolean value. And greater than for finding the greater number, which is that uh, if the left number is greater than the right number, then it will return true as the value, else it will return false. Well, less than or equal to will find whether the number on the left is either less or equal to the number on the right side. And again, greater than or equal to will check if the number on the left side is either greater or equal to the number on the right side. So now we're going to see all these symbols and mathematical functions directly implemented using a program in Python. And I'm going to write that program in my Eclipse IDE using PyDev. So you should have your Eclipse IDE with PyDev. So if you're not having that, go back to the video where I have shown how to install and set up PyDev in Eclipse IDE. So I'm going to create my file. It's going to be math dot py so once again py is the extension of python so if you are creating a python file then it has to have dot py extension so i'm finishing it so it's going to create my file so once again it's going to be the comment that i'm starting with file for mathematical function so first i'm going to use two numbers i'm going to create two variables that's going to have the numbers so one is going to be a is equal to 10 and the next is b is equal to 5 so i'm going to have these two variables and i'm going to perform a different mathematical functions with the help of the symbol on these two variables and i'm going to store them in different variables so i'm not going to alter the values in these two variables so a and b is going to remain the same throughout the program so first it's going to be addition and I'm going to add two numbers. So it's going to be add is equal to a plus b. So I'm going to get 15 as the value for add. And then subtraction sub is equal to a minus b. Okay. So let's see what's going to be the value for that. Multiplication. Sorry with that. Multiplication. MUL is equal to A asterisk B and division is going to be div, sorry, div is equal to A slash B. And finally, the modulus, which is nothing but the mod, MOD is equal to A percentage B is going to find the mod between these two numbers. And then we come to the next set of symbols, which is going to be less than, greater than, less than or equal to, greater than or equal to. We're going to again create all those things. So less than, less is equal to A, less than B. Greater than, great is equal to A, greater than B. Okay. Now, I'm going to go with greater, sorry, less and equal. L E S E Q is equal to A less than or equal to B. Okay. Sorry about those uh, suggestions. It's coming up in the middle. And greater 
and equal great eq is equal to a greater than equal to b so this actually sees all those i'm going to actually print out each one of them so i'm going to first create the print statement i'm just going to copy them and i'm going to use them multiple times so it's going to be add sub mall the mod so now we're going to come to the four other stuff. so it's less great less equal and great eq so now we're going to just print all these values and see what are all the values it's going to give out i'm going to run this file it's going to be python run press ok it's going to give out the values so now we are having 15 as the value a plus b so 10 plus 5 is 15 10 minus 5 is 5 so subtraction is fine multiplication 10 into 5 is 50 of course that's also fine and division 10 divided by phi is 2.0 you can see that the floating point value is given out when you're using division and when it comes to modulus 10 divided by phi is not going to give you any reminder so that's zero and 10 less than phi so that's false perfect the answer is given correctly and a greater than b 10 greater than b is true of course and a less than or equal to b that's going to be false of course because 10 is not less than or equal to 5 and then 10 is greater than or equal to 5 10 is greater than 5 so it's giving you true so that is how actually you do some mathematical stops with the help of python of course you can do complex mathematics with the help of multiple symbols in a single statement so that actually ends this program we have seen all those mathematical symbols that you can use in python in our next video we'll be seeing about some of the strings that you can use in python that also ends the video and thank you for watching this video and if you find this video useful please hit the like button and also subscribe to the channel and also please share this video with your friends and family and if you have any comments or suggestions or feedbacks, please feel free to share it in the comment section of this video or on a Google Plus page, Facebook page, or Twitter feed. You can also contact me personally through the social links that I've shared in the description section of this video. Thank you for watching this video. Have a great day.